Good morning. It's Monday morning. We're up here in Lodi, Ohio at a pilot truck stop where we spent the weekend. We got about 30, 40 miles over to where we have to deliver for in the morning. They want us there about 9 o'clock, so it just is 8, so that's probably going to work out pretty good. Depending on how bad traffic is up through uh, Cleveland. And once we get down to Cleveland today, we, uh, we're going to be running about 30, 35 miles over to Aurora, Ohio. Pick up our reload, which is about 30 miles away. Going down to uh, Indianapolis. So that's going to be our load for tonight, tomorrow. Bella Dog's doing good. Just waiting on traffic here. Okay, we're rolling now. Up to the stop sign. I do have, I got one issue on the truck. Turn right at the traffic light. I got, then uh, exit right. I got one drive tire that has a slow leak. Uh, I checked air pressure yesterday and it was down quite a bit. So. Take the exit on the right to I-71 North, then keep left. All right, I looked over at the tire. I did not see any nail or anything like that in the tire. So the valve could be leaking a little bit. So I will keep an eye on it. I checked it this morning. Still had air pressure this morning. Be in the left lane. So I'll check it this morning, or I'll keep an eye on it. So we're just trying to find the signs going to Cleveland here. Other than that, truck's doing good. Temperatures cooled down a little bit outside. It has been pretty, pretty warm there, especially when I was down there in Joplin, Missouri. It was pretty hot. This intersection, right in this area, is crazy. Try to figure out where to go. Belt dog's got a little safety vest on. It's working out pretty good for it.
goes down to these universities. Yeah, these universities out in, aren't out in the suburbs, they're in downtown. And uh, it just doesn't make it easy. In one quarter mile, turn right on Magnolia Drive. Hey, this is Dan. I got a load of that dirt for you out of Arizona. Uh, I'm getting ready to turn on Magnolia right now, down right downtown by the uh, university down here. I just wanted to kind of... Okay. Uh, turn right at the traffic so light. So, right now I'm turning on Magnolia. It looks like I'm going under the like uh, overpass little thing, the public walkway thing. Does that look right? Okay, all right, I just want to make sure. Okay, well I'm sitting at the light here. Hopefully uh, I can make this turn. And uh, yeah, it's a little tight. I don't know if I came the right way or not, but uh, it's a little tight back here. Just if you don't, if, if you don't, if you don't mind, just stay on the line. Just give me one minute here. I want to make sure that I'm... <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, I've, I've hauled this dirt before. I've delivered it. And every every time I have a load of this stuff, it's it's kind of chaotic trying to get to where it's got to go. Let's see here. Oh, I hope I'm going the right way. Arriving at here I'm gonna get untarped and uh, we'll get unloaded Bella dog sporting her new uh, safety vest there so what we got is uh, PVC pipe 
nice and light. I think the whole load only weighs 10,000 pounds. So uh, super simple to load, straightforward. Just throw straps over. I did put uh, one strap pulling this way. It wouldn't make that much of a difference because it's not that tall, but uh, just out of habit, I did put one strap pulling in the opposite direction. So it, uh, that's what we got. It's going about 300 miles down to Indianapolis. So uh, super simple, super easy. Can't ask for much better than that. And uh, I got over there, they were doing lunch when I got over there. So I had to wait till they got done with lunch. But uh, as soon as lunch was over, man, they jumped right on it. So uh, can't complain at all. Can't complain at all. So looks good, looks good. And this is the tire I was telling you about this morning. This tire here, I'm gonna have to keep an eye on. Uh, I checked the air pressure this morning. It was still at 110. So uh, I'm just gonna have to keep an eye on that tire, make sure that was the one that was leaking air. So. Uh, I will keep an eye on that one. Other than that, truck's doing okay. No major issues. Truck's looking good. There's Bella Dog. So uh, it's a nice, nice, easy day. No, it, it's been a nice, easy day today. Can't complain. So uh, we're gonna drive for about another five, five, six hours. Get on over to uh, Indianapolis, and uh, we'll call it quits. So uh, talk to you in a bit. All right, we made it over here to. Clayton, Indiana. We're about 10 miles from where we got to deliver in the morning. We're going to Plainfield, Indiana to deliver. Um, today was a good day. We got a lot done. Drove a lot too. So uh, that went pretty good. Uh, a little stressful in downtown Cleveland, but eh, it's all right. Part of the job. Uh, we booked the load. Uh, we're loading tomorrow out of uh here anyway i gotta take her out here in a second um we're loading tomorrow out of muncie going up to uh milwaukee wisconsin and then we're reloading out of uh, janesville wisconsin going to michigan so we are set That'll be, let's see, tomorrow's Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So we're set all the way up to Thursday. And then uh, we'll find something out of Thursday to uh, to load out of Michigan. So, but uh, so far, so good. All right, it's the end of the day. I got to take Bella Dog out, put a little safety vest on, and um, I'm going to go get a shower. And uh, we'll do it again tomorrow. Talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye. I said you have a good one. Alright, it's nice meeting you.